One of America's biggest makers of child safety seats is recalling millions of its products. Graco says parents are having too much trouble unbuckling those car seats. No children are hurt, but federal officials say the company is not telling the whole story. Jeff Puget is in Washington, where there is now a push to widen the recall. Jeff, good morning. Good morning, Charlie and Nora. This is one of the largest recalls for car seats that we've seen in quite some time. Great call, Graco recalling nearly 3.8 million car seats, and we're going to show you one that I have in my car for my four-year-old. The recall is all about the harness buckle. This is it. Parents are saying that this buckle is sticking, preventing them from getting their child out of the car seat. It's important to press the button near the indentation at the top of the button. Graco is recalling 11 out of the 18 models manufactured between 2009 and 2013 after complaints that the harness buckle sticks in the lock position. The National Highway Traffic Safety Administration warns the problem could make it difficult to get a child out of the seat during an emergency. Oliver was small. That's what concerned Arjan Frady, four-year-old Oliver's mother. It's not safe for a kid to be stuck in their car seat. Ready to go? Frady bought the Graco size 4ME70 in 2012. She says other car seats take 10 seconds to operate. This one took 45. What if the car blows up in those extra 45 seconds it takes you to pull out all the straps, take the kid out. You should be able to just get it done instantly. In a statement, Graco told us food and dried liquids can make some harness buckles progressively more difficult to open over time or become stuck in the latched position. But CBS This Morning has obtained government letters to Graco that call the company's explanation inaccurate and misleading to consumers. Officials have been pressing Graco to recall an additional 2 million rear-facing infant car seats, which use the same type of buckle, telling Graco it may take legal action to force a recall. CBS News has learned that the recall could affect other brands with similar buckles. Frady says despite the issues, she still trusts Graco, but wishes the company addressed the issue sooner. This has been an issue since, I believe, 2009. It shouldn't have taken from 2009 to 2013 to fix the issue. There have been thousands of complaints from parents, parents who are saying that they've actually had to cut their kids out of the harness to get them out of this car seat. Charlie, Nora. Jeff, thanks.